All right, YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Uh, we are now in Act 4, and we are going to go over the pathing important quests as well as uh, the fastest way to just get to the boss. Um, so if you had any questions or just need to help find your way, if you're lost, this is the video for you. All right, so we just got out of Act 3. They played, they put us here. Uh, we can just start moving right away. We're going to come down here. There's actually only three zones. So we're entering zone number one. They are all giant square-ish zones. Um, but as far as where the exits are, that is random. Um, so we are just going to start hitting the edges. We're looking for a little stairway that takes us out of this giant square and into the next one. So that's the stairway there. Uh, before you go here, there is an important quest here, which is to kill Visual. Um, that quest, what you want to make sure is if you have a quest thing here, you want to click on it, look at everything, and and then get out of your quest log so that it disappears. Uh, the, the big red quest icon. Um, because when it disappears as you're going through here, especially if you're a sorceress and you're teleporting around, um, when you find him or get close to him, it actually will pop up the little quest log button. And that way you know. Oh, that's him right here, Isual. He's literally he's a beefy boy. Um, once you kill him, though, you can you have to wait for the angel to come down. Um, actually, I don't think it's going to happen because I already killed him pretty soon. Anyways, you talk to the angel. Make sure you talk to the angel. Come in here. Talk to Tyrael, and he'll actually give you two skill points that you can use, uh, which is very, very nice. Um, so that is a must-do quest. Um, you can save all these uh, quests for later, the important ones. I usually do. I just do them all at once later. Um, but if you want to do it on the way, or if you need the extra points because you're struggling uh, killing things or something like that, I definitely get it done. Uh, we're still looking for stairs again. We can kind of see the other edge of the map over here, so we know that the stairs are this way. Um, in here, we are kind of going to the middle. Uh, we're just looking for a cave that takes us down. Um, usually it's in the middle-ish. We will port around and see what we can see. Perfect. Uh, the waypoint is always right outside of the hole. I guess we'll call it a hole. Um, and we're actually almost, almost done. There is a... This, this area is always randomized, however, it, it is always northeast we want to go. Yep. And so we're just going to start going that way. Um, there is a nook somewhere. I like to call these kind of dead ends nooks in the map. Um, there is a nook that has the... We already passed it. We'll go back. Uh, we'll get the waypoint. Let's see if we can find the nook. There is a nook in which we do the other... There's only three quests in here. Um, we just The first one was kill Isual. The second one is to do... The forge um and that is what we're looking for right now so we're just looking for the nook which probably is right here yep i killed him by accident but you kill him here he drops his little hell forge hammer you will actually have to pick up the hammer equip it and when you kill mephisto you get mephisto soul stone uh, if you don't pick it up or leave it or drop it or whatever you can get one from kane i think they have a patch so if you don't have it you just click it anyways and it'll be there. Did I already do this one? Didn't. Let's do it real quick, just for just for fun. Um, so Kane will give it to you. And put it there. Break it. Um, you may get some rune, a rune for it. Uh, it's not going to be the highest rune in hell. I think the highest you can get is a um, whatever's under a vex rune. Um, but you get some perfect stuff, which is pretty cool. Um, and then, yeah, once you use the thing, on it disappears. Uh, that is the second quest. Unnecessary, but uh, maybe you need jewels, maybe you need runes. Might be worth doing. Um, we are going to go here. This map is always the same at this point on. It's always going to look like this. Um, you're going to go over here. You're going to pop these seals. Uh, this seal is gonna spawn a one of the two one of the two seals is gonna spawn a, a, a pack just be ready for them um and the next seal is over here there's only one up here um it spawns a dude or a pack just be ready for them kill them and then there's two seals over here um they spawn a pack just kill them once you get the, kill the last seal it'll kill all the mobs in the area 
Um, except for those special groups. You won't kill them. You have to kill the, them themselves. But once you've killed all the special groups and open all the seals, the whole map will be wiped. Diablo says his thing. He comes down. And, um... Oh my god. I don't have my buffs on. <laughs> um, okay, he's dead. Uh, you kill Diablo. Let's go back to town. You can talk to this guy. He's going to open up a big red portal. And that's going to take you to Act 4. Easy peasy. Alright, well thanks so much for watching. That was a short one. The reason uh, that was so short is because when they were developing the game, they cut Act 4 short so they could launch it. Um, so that's why Act 4 is the shortest act. Um, but anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, stay tuned. Follow, subscribe for more tips and everything. Uh, have a great day. Peace, peace.